Winter Santiago on camera, finally easing outside with some Department of Correction issued clothing. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. You know, Winter can't do that, girl. You know, she been locked up the entire time, but child, she still is delusional. If you have not already done so, please remember to like, share to Facebook, and subscribe because it is so important to our success here on the YouTube. And if you are not already a part of our book club, please remember to hit the Patreon link below and or the join button here on the YouTube and for a small monthly fee of $5. You babies, yes you can be privy to all the shenanigans before the YouTube gets it, if the YouTube gets it. Now, let's talk about Sister Soldier's life after death for winter, part one. All right, so the book opens up, okay? It's a couple of years later. I don't know how many got that going years later. I don't know. I think it's like 15 or something like that, whatever the books say, okay? It's trivial to me, right? But... Winter is coming out of the jail with her good fur, you know, her proclivities on, all right? She got her shades on. Yes, Winter Santiago has been released from jail. Yes, it's a whole crew of cameras and paparazzis and peoples singing, Winter, 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 ah, Winter. She's just soaking it up. Yes, I am Winter Santiago. I am, what's her pappy name? What's her daddy name? Ricky Santiago's daughter. Mm hmm And these people are outside of the jail waiting for me. Mm hmm They show sure is. You know what else is waiting outside the jail for you? A sniper. Okay? Pow, pow, up! Oh, I've been shot. Everything is deep black. Oh, shit. That's how I know. I went to Santiago and the one who got shot dead. This is fucked up though, seconds after my prison release, right when I was about to earn a big bag. Lights out. Let me explain to you this book. The reason why it's called Life After Death is cause Winter fitting to be old uh, Bob Cratchit and travel through what would be her life after she kicked the bucket, okay? So we're gonna go through some scenes, but you have to remember it's a, it's a dream. It's her overseeing it all, like uh, kind of like a Christmas curl, okay? Keep that in mind. Wait a minute. Was Bob Cratchit the, the – no, 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 Scrooge, okay? The Scrooge. She goes back in time, and then she goes forward in time. She two right. weeks prior to her release from the Department of Corrections, okay? She is on the prison phone talking to Portia's husband, Elijah, okay? By the way, we chose Paige Heard. DMX's goddaughter, to uh, portray Porsche, okay? And, of course, we are keeping Tiana Taylor as Winter Santiago. Everybody loves the Tiana Taylor. Okay. Porsche is married to this grand, huge, big movie producer, right? The movie producer is on the phone with uh, Winter Santiago trying to convince her that if she did this reality TV show, she would get a great big bag, okay? So, you know, even though she's been locked up, she's still a money-hungry hoe, okay? I mean, once you a money-hungry hoe, that never really truly leaves you. It, sometimes it may go deep down in your soul after you get married. Oh, but it's still there, okay? So she is talking to um, um, Elijah, Portia's husband, about the possibilities, let me say that, of her becoming a reality TV star. I have seen bunches of bitches on reality TV ridiculously playing themselves like crazy. Me too, Winter. 
Me too. We all have. We all still trying to figure out what the fuck is going on on the reality TV show. But let me, you know, move forward. Damn. Winter Santiago on camera finally easing outside with some Department of Correction issued clothing. Mm-mm. <clears throat> you know, Winter can't do that, girl. You know, she's been locked up the entire time, but child, she still is delusional. She's saying that that's really and truly all the inmates had to wear anyway, you know, other than the clothes that they came in with. Taking it back right quick. Remember, you know, when the big thing happened, when uh, Winter got pinched, right? You know, she in the projects with her boyfriend. I forget the name of the dude. He wasn't shit. Right, but she was in the project with the dude in the coldest winter ever. He set her up. The police came in. She got all kinds of drugs and money and stuff in the car. She trying to get out the car. Answer no, you can't go nowhere. Uh, Simone and came in and cut her face open. And she just had a bad day that day. Okay, so she's saying all she had was the clothes that she went to jail with. Okay, and Simone chopped all that up. Okay, because that's how they get down in Brooklyn. That's according to, I believe that's so. I believe that's so. That them Brooklyn people be, yeah. She, in her mind, like, no, I have to be fabulous when I step out the building. Yes, you do, Winter Santiago. Yes, you do. Thinking over the reality show offer while speaking on the prison phone with the show creator and executive producer, my brother-in-law, Elijah Emanuel. We're good looking out, Elijah. I told him. I thought about it like you asked me to do. But uh, let it be the last time, because I told you I wasn't going to do it. Well, then negotiate, my sister Porsche said. Winter didn't know that Porsche was on the other line. I don't know why. I don't know why it's her husband. Porsche okay. says to Winter, Winter, what do you want out of it? There must be something you're ready to gain. Just let my husband know what you want. Winter, you are the star of this show. Only you can make it happen. Until you sign the contract, you're in the power position. After all is said and done, it's about 500 bitches serving mandatory minimum for basically no reason except for being the boyfriend or the girlfriend to the boyfriend who was the man. Elijah chose me because I'm the bad bitch. The royalty. Precisely. What is this bitch talking and about? Portia is like, uh, just tell Elijah what you want. What do you want to be done so that we can make this reality show happen? Okay, first thing this hussy thinking out her mind is, oh, I want to be fly stepping out of the jail. Okay, all right, you can do that. She breaks it down. I want to have Tom Ford this, Gucci dad, you know, Chanel this, and blah, 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 and blah, blah, blah. And Elijah, I want this red carpet. I want paparazzi. I want cameras flashing. I want the whole vig. And to top it off, at the end of that red carpet, I want midnight to meet me with a Bentley. Okay, bitch. It's your dream. It's your dream. It's your, it's your life after the death. So okay. it seems that Winter is not the same selfish, self-absorbed little girl that she was when she went in the jail. Okay, that's befuddling. But let's move forward, okay? She says to Elijah, oh, yeah, I need you to hook up a couple of my girls, too. Okay? Because, I mean, who's she going to be on the show with, Right? She got to talk to somebody, you know, they, she got to talk to somebody about labels and drinking crystals and sucking pickle. She okay. says, I'm going to pick a few of my girls. I want you to hook them up too. I'm going to be fuddled. We will put your girls, up to five of them, in the reality TV show cast and pay them a nice appearance fee. This way, they can afford their own apartments. You can live with us like Porsche planned. I was silent. Because I was thinking, I don't want to live with my little sister. Uh-uh, that's not going to happen. And then she be the boss of me. You uh -uh. need that family support when you come home so your ass won't go back in, you dumb bitch. But anyway, Portia chimes in and she said, listen, you're going to have your own interests, entrance, you know, your own, you know, whatever it is you want, your own space. Because Porsche is married to this big time uh, um, a movie producer, okay? So they got house that they can share. Winter's like, no, that won't happen. No, not me. I should. I went to Santiago, live with my baby sister. And so, no, why not, Winter? You've been living with bitches for the past 15 damn years, okay? You've been sharing a bunk with bitches you don't know for 15 years. Now, all of a sudden, you got to go out and you can't live in your sister's extra house. Your deal is worth 50000 per show, 16 episodes per season. After it hits, and you and I know it will, you'll be in a position to negotiate 
and clear even more than the 800,000 that is generated from your first season, okay? Now let me let me tell you this. Okay? Elijah Elijah, sir, I don't know you, sir. Okay? But uh see the wording in this tells me that this ain't nothing but a pilot. Okay? This is a pilot, okay? Ain't nobody signed on to it yet. You're trying to create a show, shop it around to different networks, see if they'll bite. Okay? See if they'll bite. Because nothing is guaranteed that any of these networks want to pick up this show. But Elijah believes in this grand, in this grand reality TV show centered around Winter Santiago and the dumb bitches with her. Now, she continues on to tell uh, Elijah of all the things that she want upon her release, right? Mm -hmm, you know. And it's funny that Elijah ain't, you know, called her out and said, you tripping? Yeah. So she goes over the top and says, okay, so the... Um, the Bentley that uh, Midnight is going to pick me up in, I needed to have it stocked with Crystal and, you know, Hoochie Coochie and blah, 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 blah. Now, Elijah right. says, okay, so uh, you do know that Midnight is married. You do know that, right? Yes, but he'll come. I mean, it's me. It's uh, Winter Santiago, Ricky Santiago's daughter. He'll come. Okay, bitch. I mean, I'll try. We'll try. Elijah says, where is there anything else? Yes, there's one more thing. But I need you to meet me so we can talk about it face to face. And Elijah, if you can't do this one thing, then I will not sign the contract. Now, Winter says the reason why she doesn't want to live with Porsche is because Porsche worries too much. That's a beautiful thing when your sisters worry about you, okay? She said that Porsche can't handle it and she will become annoying when Winter is out here trying to do dumb shit. I, let me do my dumb in peace. Okay, Porsche, I don't want to hear your mouth. Okay, and I can see you waiting in the daggone, uh, what is that? The, the driveway waiting for me when I come in the house drunk with a nigga. I can see that, Porsche. So, but like Porsche said, you'll be over here, they'll be over there. Okay, eventually, Elijah was like, look, bitch, you asking for the moon. At least you can do is save me some money and live in a damn extra house or the guest house. Can a dead bitch think? My thoughts shifted as soon as my mind mentioned Santiago. That was my first love. Now, remember I told you she Bob Cratchit in this out, okay? Or uh, uh, Scrooge McDuffin this out, okay? She is um, in her body, but her spirit is traveling, okay? Her spirit has traveled to Santiago's jail cell. He ain't coming home, ever. Never, okay? Never, never, never. Because he didn't chopped up a couple of people while he was in jail. She sees her father. She's hovering. She's there, but she's not there. She can see her father. She on that incestual bullshit again. Where she's like, look at his chin. It's all chiseled and, you know, beautiful. His body. Okay. Yes. Yes. We're going to keep Eastside Morales as Santiago, okay? But she, you know, hovering. Her spirit is around in the jail. Watching her father get dressed. Girl! Girl, something ain't right. Something ain't right. That's not the book. That, that right there, you is killing me with that. She's watching her father, thinking about how, uh, you know, powerful and still attractive he is. And, you know, just he is the man and what he used to be. And she's thinking to herself, I know my father's going to kill the person that shot me. I just know this. But nah, not my father. Mm -mm. I can't have that. I don't want my father to get out of jail only to get back in jail for killing a man or the woman that killed me. Nah, I'm going to do this myself. I'm going to be the one to get him out of here. Even though he's serving life, Papa's release is sure to happen. It was the condition I gave Elijah. The one thing that would cause the whole entire reality show followed up by a major motion picture, followed up by a television series, followed up by Winter Santiago's video game to fall through and be nothing without it. So she's saying, you know, the, the thing that she need to talk to Elijah about face to face at the jail is the only way we can do this is if my papa get out. Okay. That's it. I ain't doing this. Okay. That is the main thing. Okay, just the Vista. I want my father to be released. 
I want both of us to come up back to where we belong, to be the royal high that we were before, but even higher. But three gunshots later, the plan is deferred. Who killed me? That's all I wanted to know. Revenge, that's all I wanted to get. Yeah, I was mad about losing out on a money bag that I was about to earn, but I was more furious that I could not be there to see Santiago get out and come home. Now I want to put down whoever shot me before Papa gets home and gave the order to eliminate that person and whoever was on that person's team. Now, if you have not already done so, please remember to like, share to Facebook, and subscribe because it is so important to our success here on the YouTube. Remember this. The same people you meet on the way up are going to be the same people that you meet on the way down. My naysayers, my patron loves you, babies. Y'all have a good one. Peace.